Welcome to FanCast.com's American Idol Vlog. I'm Justin Guarini, reporting from the road in Los Angeles here with uh, reflections and all. Sorry, it's what I got to work with in the hotel. But moving on to the most important thing, America voted through another three contenders into the top 12. I'll be touching on the moments that stood out to me and weighing in on America's picks. Now first off, the obligatory group numbers really do show who can perform and who can't, don't they? If you looked around at who can move and who kind of can't when they sing or who moves a little too much, if you know what I mean, well, I'm just going to leave it at that. All in all, it was a better group song than last week, but the group numbers have always, even from season one, left something to be desired for me. I just can't stop. I just can't stop. In the biggest non-surprise of the night, Allison goes through to the next round. I mean, come on, no, we all saw this coming because she was clearly one of the best performers of last night. Next, the biggest actual surprise for me was watching Chris beat out Megan. <laughs> Chris should not have gone through based on last night's performance. But, I get it because he's going to have more, vul more mobility and vocal variety in the top 12. Megan, she's really unique, but has a smaller vocal range in terms of genre. She is absolutely beautiful though, but guess whose votes hold the most power on Idol? Girls' votes. And they chose Chris. Better luck next time, Megan. After a performance by the lovely Brooke White that brought back memories of Carly Simon, The contestants were put into a pop lineup after the obvious casts off were, well, cast off. Ryan pared it down to Nick slash Norman and Adam Lambert. For a brief moment, I thought it might be Nick. Nah, come on! There would have been a public outcry and the reputation of Idol would have really taken a nosedive. Thankfully, here's what happened. Nick, you are not through to the top 12 tonight. Adam, you take the final score. Adam went through, and all was right with the world. Now next week is going to be the last week America votes for their favorites. Hopefully we'll have some hot performances. Then the judges uh, take their turn to pick from the people we left out in the cold. I'm going to go out on a limb and say that the people we choose from and the people we put through are going to be Lil Rounds, Scott, and Taylor. But that's just me. What do you think? For FanCast.com, I'm Justin Guarini. See you next week.